So guys, that's how Omena powder is prepared. Hi everyone, I welcome you on this, on this channel, African Mother Village Content Creator, right from Central Uganda. In case you're new here, kindly do consider subscribing, liking, commenting, and sharing my videos by returning viewers. Thank you so very much for always coming through to watch African Mwala. I really appreciate you all. Peace. And actually, I'm so happy in today's video, I'm going to showcase how we do Omena powder in an African way village way yes so let's start right there this is omena silverfish yeah i know you guys you're aware of it so i'm just picking out some like some some unusual things because the stones involved in them yeah So today I'm using a charcoal stove. Now after that, this is what we do. We put it on fire so that it can roast out very well. Let me improvise. They, they have to be golden brown as you see they're turning out slowly by soil into golden brown uh, they are ready just like this yeah. so this is how it is they are really ready In my second home, we have a, a small motor. <laughs> this is how we do it. This is it and the, it's having some crumbs because some are hard but then most of the of them are powder mm. you can even test them and eat just like them but there's another way of eating this omega powder you watch the video till the end don't skip guys uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't skip. So now, guys, I'm peeling my toke. As you know, these are green bananas. Green bananas. You know, so the one who was holding the camera is away. So I'm just having a hard time, yeah? To shoot a video, a selfie video, it's hard to shoot a selfie video. Uh, yeah. 
but no matter what we are good to go so we are still on the process of omena but this knife can cut guys look wasted your food hmm. So if you don't have any net, this is what we do when you don't have any net, like this, yeah, these are clean guys, that's clean. So in the village we improvise, we do improvise. No waste of resources. You cover so that that scent can just that aroma can just enter the aroma of the green bananas. Ha! Let's continue. Our matto You see the natural delicacy. So this is how it has to turn out, the meat. Look at this. I'm just dropping these. Mm, just like that. <laughs> uh, Erina told me this, that you just drop there everything and it comes out very well. This is real oil, guys. Real ones. So I'm going to put it here on fire so that it can boil and we give it some time to boil. Then you watch the whole process. Ooh, wow. So what is ready is our meat mixed with oh man now so this is it oh guys come and see So you see, I put many, like when the, the just without, eh, look at it, look at it. Woo. Hmm. I think I can, let me do like this. My hand is clean, guys. Don't say that I'm dirty. You know you people, you always tell me that you have to be clean. What and what? So this is the gully. Now I'm going to pound. Mm, guys, the aroma is just a boiled aroma. <laughs> the aroma is just wow. So, oh, it is just tasty. <laughs> now, let me show you how they do it with omena here. Yeah? This is how they do it. It's omena, omena. And our meat is omena, omena. I mean, it's that town. Right? Hmm. Here is omena, omena. Mm -hmm. You just sprinkle on your food just like that. Mm. God bless this, amen. Mm. 
This is a natural delicacy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So guys, that's how omena powder is prepared. <coughs> <coughs> Look at the soup. <coughs> I do not. <coughs> this is wow. <coughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. This is the onion, the one I dip when it is hot. This is the garlic, pepper, omena soup, meat. Mm. So thank you guys for watching. I love you so very much, my good people. See you in the next coming video. Bye-bye.